Scholars here. She's got the ball. She actually scored the three-pointer right at the buzzer, and Leah Leah took the shot. The Kios has the ball now. 23-point lead for Northwood, their largest lead of the game. Scholar kicks it out to Leah. Leah takes a three-pointer. Oh, that one kind of went in and out, and she is fouled. That was not a shot, is on the floor foul, so we have a situation where Miss <laughs> Glover gets another two, so she has nine points total. She had seven in the first half. bringing up the ball for Lee. All right, uh, at this point, I think it's pretty much safe to say that Northwood, unless they really, 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 really screw up, are gonna win this game. That shot was by Meredith Bean. She's in for the game at this point. Takia gets the rebound, she's bringing it up. She is having a really nice game this game. She will be playing at college next year. I forget what school it is. Beautiful. Takia gets two and a plus one. It's a 27 point lead for Northwood right now. Getting ready for this plus one shot. Shot goes up and good. She's five for seven on free throws right now. And let's see how many points she's got. Eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17 points. Rebound by 43 and she gets fouled. Six twenty-seven left in this game. Shot goes up and in. Forty-six nineteen. Twenty-six point difference. Let's see what that eight times three, nine times three. That's nine possessions. That's assuming you get three points for each possession. And we have a timeout. We'll be back after that. Gene Gallon with the Chatham Journal. Mm -hmm. We're back after the timeout, and we have a foul. 6-18. A couple of free throws probably for Lee County. Second round of the North Carolina High School Athletic Association basketball playoffs is going to be on Thursday. Um, in most cases, the girls' games will be at 6, the boys' games will be at 7.30. So you can watch for the Northwood girls to be back here at home on Thursday at 6 o'clock. That's good, 46-21, 25-point lead for Northwood. Scholar's bringing up the ball. Back to Takia. There you go. She worked her way in between, uh, but the shot did not go in. And I've seen many a time where she'll find her way in between the crowd and score successfully. Got a couple free throws coming in. First shot goes in. 
one for one on the free throws. Has another shot coming up. Second shot goes up and in. She's got a total of 10 points for this game. And we get another foul. 5.56 left on the clock in the game. 48-21, 27-point lead for Northwood. Number 43 is up there for a couple of shots. Shot bounces out. The gym is filling up. The boys do come in at 7.30. Not everybody can make it out here for the 6 o'clock game because, again, depending on where you work. Takia has the rebound. Gives it off to Schuyler. Schuyler's bringing it up. She's driving. Nope. She hands it up. Boom. Nice. Another nice assist from Skyler. Shot is blocked. He has got it. Skyler called for a play. Over to Takia. There you go. Nice assist from Meredith to Takia. Takia's got another two points. She's got 19 points. Unofficially speaking, of course. That looked like it was going to go in. Skyler has the rebound. All right, she's going all the way. Nope. Same as the last play. Another nice assist. Five points for Aaliyah. And we go with a timeout. Worst thing about sitting down here is occasionally, which just happened, my leg falls asleep which means it's going to stay up all night. But, uh, yeah, I went over to get a shot of the team at the bench for the timeout, and it's like, ugh. Four twenty-three left. Oh, my gosh, we're down to a 23-point lead. They were up as much as 28. I think Coach Snipes had a talk with them about not getting too loosey-goosey. And there's a fight for the ball. Sarah's got it. She protects it. Got it over to Meredith. Meredith has got it into the hands of Nia. Aaliyah's got it. She takes a shot, bounces out hard. Who gets it? Lee County. They're taking it the other way. Four minutes. Four minutes left in this first round state playoff game. Nia's got it. Back over Nia. Coach Knight's put in a bunch of subs right now. Give him a little bit of uh, playing time. Nia's got it. And actually looking at my list, none of the starters are in there at the moment. The neat thing at this point is when the subs score, you will see the starters cheer for their teammates. Takes a shot. Nope. Comes up short. 2.55 left on the clock.
He has got it. I think she's going the whole way. Yes. And there you go. We got a timeout. Nice shot by Nia. The score is 56 21 with 232. And we've got a timeout, folks. All right, Coach Snipes has put in even more subs. Um, let's see, Anna, number 32 is in there. Aaliyah, number 10, is still in there. Who else is in there? I can't see the numbers right now. Got blockage. See Kira Pat Parish number 21's in there. Shot goes up. Bounces out. Elise Watson's out there. That's good for two. 56-23. Aliyah's got the ball. Two minutes left. The thing I like about games like this is when they get the subs in, I can get some pictures of subs. Boom! Aliyah's got another three. She's got two threes. And a regular basket, so she's got eight points total. Boom, that's two points over there for Lee County. 140 left in this game. Elise Watson was bringing it up, lost it. It's Lee County, and Lee County's bringing in subs as well. So again, at this point, Lee County's pretty much said, hey, uh, Northwood's got this game. Let's have the subs play and participate in a playoff game. We get a timeout, full timeout by Northwood. 117 left on the clock. One minute. It's the side of the backboard coming back this way. A lot of pressure putting on. And do we have a foul? I don't know. Now Lee is in the bonus. Looks like there's enough fouls on Northwood where they would be in a one and one situation. Shot goes up and in. 43 seconds left. Rebound lead, 28 seconds left. It looks like we have a foul. Shot goes up, does not go in. Getting ready for the second shot. Shot's good, 59-29. Do we have a foul?
Nope. North with ball. They need some help over there. Seventeen point four seconds. Long three pointer. In and out. That's good for two. Fifty nine thirty. Got nine, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. She gets fouled. And yes, the bench is happy. So Kira Parrish has an opportunity. She's got two free throws, opportunity to pick up a couple points here. First one, off to the side. And backtrack, so if she makes it, we can get a video of it. And she's ready for the second shot. Second shot goes up, that one does not go in. He gets the rebound, and that's it. We have run out of time. Final score here at Northwood, 59-30. Northwood will move on to play the winner of Western Alamance versus Hunt School. And my feeling is they'll probably be playing Western Alamance here on Thursday night. Hey, Gene Gallon with the Chatham Journal, thank you so much for watching. Hey, if you do not mind, can you do us a favor? Just go ahead and give us a thumbs up at least. And if you, you can also subscribe, and that means every time when you subscribe, every time we put up a new video, you will get a notification. So, hey, thanks so much for watching, and we are going to be doing the boys game next. Bye.